Hi everyone, Jim from Javelin here with another SolidWorks tip. I have here a gripper subassembly and it uses a swivel gripper and it's got these fingers that basically swing out to the side. Now if I were to try and drag that it says it's fully defined so I can't drag it but if I open up my uh, swivel gripper subassembly that I got from my supplier I can move these fingers. Now unfortunately they're supposed to move together but they don't because they're not they're not mated to do so yet so I'm going to show you how to do that I'm going to click on mate I'm going to go down to my advanced mates here at the bottom I'll scroll back up and I'm going to use a symmetry mate for my symmetry plane I'm going to use my right plane which is already in the middle and with this for my actual selections I could pick the points I can pick edges or I can even pick faces. And now when I apply this mate, if I move one, the other will move. So now it behaves sort of similar to uh, to how the actual grippers do, but actual grippers can't do that. So I also want to limit how far this can go. So I'm going to pick on these two faces. Actually, no, I'll go to mate and then I'll get advanced mates and then I can use a uh, a limit angle mate between these two faces and I can specify that I want this a maximum of we'll say 90 and we'll make this 0 so now if I click apply I can drag this anywhere between 90 and 0 the actual dimensions are probably a little bit different I should have checked the, uh, the supplier catalog anyways I go back to my top level assembly and I'm still left with the same problem. Now I remember what I came over here to do. Okay, so when I rebuild, I can update it, but I can't control it at this at this level. I have to always go into this uh this swivel gripper subassembly and then go over here and run the update. But what I want to do is, like I say, I want to be able to control it at this level. So what I can do is I can right-click on this, go to Component Properties, and then I have an option down here to solve as either rigid or flexible. So if I solve as flexible, then it means anything that I can do in terms of dragging components in this swivel gripper subassembly, I can now do at this gripper assembly, gripper subassembly level.